In today's video, I'm gonna share with you how I manifested half a million dollars in a weekend and how you can apply these same exact steps and tools to your life so you can do the same. By the way, as I'm making this video, you know, it's been a year since my first live event and four years prior to that, I was so broken, so broken, I had my car repossessed, I had about $40,000 of credit cards that I just stopped paying on and I let everything go. And the reason I share that with you is because I didn't start with a bunch of money, I didn't come from a bunch of money, I use these techniques and these tools to pull me from being out of the gutter to literally doing half a million dollars in a weekend. And so I wanna share with you the step-by-step -step tools that I use. So in the year of 2022, we were at, we did about $558,000 that year. And so we averaged just under $50,000 a month. And in the month of December, I came across a technique called quantum leaping. And I started to read into and listen to audiobooks about what quantum leaping was. So to give you the short version of what quantum leaping is, it's going, becoming the person you wanna be, creating a life that you wanna, lead, uh, that you wanna live without necessarily doing it step by step and more so making a huge leap to that person. Now, let me give you guys a huge warning because I will say this, when you are quantum leaping, you are gonna go through some pain, you're gonna go through some challenges, and so you have to have the mental fortitude to push through the pain and through those barriers, because if not, it will cause you a lot of stress and you may end up giving up. And the reason I share that with you is let me give you this analogy that I'm gonna share with you the, the, the process that I used. So if you wanna learn the splits in six months, it's probably not gonna be that painful. If you wanna learn the splits in six weeks, it's gonna be a lot more painful than learning in six months. And then if you wanna learn the splits in six days, it's probably gonna cause you a lot of pain and might even cause you some damage. So when you're quantum leaping, be aware that it's like going from where you want to be to where you're at, instead of it taking six years or six months, you know, you're doing it in a very quick process. Now, sometimes it takes longer than six months. I'm just giving you an example. So in December of 2022, I started researching quantum leaping and I decided, you know what? I want to 10X my revenue and I want to go from averaging $50,000 a month to doing half a million dollars in a month. Now, one important thing to keep in mind is I did not know how this was going to happen. At this point in my life, I had no, I had an idea of what I could do, but it wasn't 100% clear. So. In, the, in a quantum leap, essentially what you wanna do is really hyper-focus on one task, one goal that you really wanna achieve that when you achieve this goal, it could change everything in your life. And you know it's similar to having a vision board, but instead of having 20 different things, you wanna have one specific thing that you focus on. Now what I did is instead of having a board, I kept a picture of what I wanted on my phone. So I had half a million dollars on my Stripe account, which is my merchant account, having the numbers you know, show up there in a monthly, in a monthly uh, month time span. Now, by the way, guys, do me a favor. If you made it this far in the video, comment some of your manifestations down below. Like, what are you working on? What are you manifesting right now? Because I would love, really love to hear your feedback. So every day I would meditate for about 10 minutes and imagining what it would feel like to hit that half a million dollars in one month and I would visualize it and often I would get insight and different downloads and different things. And then you go on about your day and you let it unfold as, if, as it happens. Now, one of the biggest mistakes that people make when manifesting is they wanna know exactly every step of the way. It's like, here's point A, here's point B, and you need to know exactly every twist and turn along the way, and that's just not the case. So, and, and honestly, that's part of the journey. That's what makes it fun. If you knew, it's like watching a movie, knowing everything that's about to happen. It's not as interesting as when you don't know anything that's about to happen. So think of life in that way. We want the unknowns. We want the twists and turns and the excitement because that's what makes it fun. So for 10 minutes a day, I visualize what it would feel like, what it would be like, what I'm gonna do when I hit that half a million dollars in a month. So what was interesting is in the month of December, we did about $70,000 um, in revenue. And the very next month, we doubled it, almost, almost doubles, exactly 139,000. So December, we did 70K. The very next month, we did 139,000. 
And then each month after that, it went up, you know, 160, 180, 200, 250, so on and so forth. Well, in April of 2022, I went to, or no, was this 2023? Oh my, yeah. So December, 2022, I said, okay, I'm going to quantum leap. Last year in April of 2023, I went to a mastermind. It was a two day mastermind and I'm sitting there and there's about 70 people in the room and there's a couple, you know, people going up on stage and they're talking about business and motivation and all this stuff. Right. And as I'm sitting there, I kept thinking to myself, man, I should be the one up on stage. Like I can do this. And honestly, I was even thinking like, I'm better than some of these speakers that are coming up here. Like that should be me. So it was interesting. It was a two day thing. And that Friday night, I went back to my hotel. I'm in beautiful Miami. The weather's perfect. I'm ha you know, I ended up going to the UFC fights that weekend. I made a lot of great people. Like I'm just, it's just a great weekend. And for some reason on that Friday night, I went back to my room and I felt anxious and I felt off. And so I didn't know why. So I closed my eyes and I do a self hypnosis breakthrough, which for those of you who have gone through my hypnosis program, this is what we teach you how to self clear your limiting beliefs. So anyways, I go through and what I discovered, the reason I was feeling anxious is because I was supposed to be on stage. I was supposed to be doing that with my life. And so once I cleared it, I said, okay, this is what we're doing. I'm going to book a hotel in Vegas and we're, we're doing this, right? We're going to make this happen. So literally the next day I call my fiance, who's going to be my soon to be wife. And I call her, I said, Hey, we're booking a hotel. When I get back to Vegas, we're going to start looking at different venues. I said, that's it. We're making it happen. I didn't want to try to let myself back out or overthink it. I just dive in. I'm a doer. When I, when I find something that I want to do, I just attack and go after it and figure it out as we go. I don't need all the answers before I get started, because if I do, I'll get bogged down with the details and I'll, and I'll back out. So I like to just go, let's figure out the details on the way. It was funny because that same day she was like buying a car over the phone. So I'm negotiating buying this car and you know, getting, you know, whatever. So anyways, we made that decision. I get back, we start looking at all these different venues. Finally, we end up going with the nicest hotel in downtown Las Vegas called Circle Hotel. So now, you know, I signed the agreement and it's a, you know, a, a pretty hefty investment for, for most, you know, most people's standards. And I'm like, all right, I have five months to figure out how we're going to get a hundred people in this room. And mind you, I've never done an in-person training. I didn't know if anybody was going to go. I had no tickets sold, nothing. I literally just said, this is what we're doing and we're doing it. And so for the next five months, as we started getting clients into our system, you know, we started promoting it. We started getting people to, to, to come out to our event. So fast forward, this is August, I believe 19th, 18th or 19th. So it's only exactly a year from today. I, we have our live event. Now, mind you, I started quantum leaping uh, in December of 2022. So this was nine months later. And in that weekend, if we combine in that weekend, we did about $400,000 in sales. And that didn't include my monthly revenue at the time, which was over a hundred thousand. I don't remember what it was exactly. So anyways, we ended up doing half a million dollars in that month. That wasn't all profit. I probably took home, I don't know, 200 grand, 250 grand, probably about 240, something like that. I can't remember. It's been a year. And that set me on the trajectory of helping people on bigger, larger scales. Now, one of the things that's really important as I was making this quantum leap is it's not just about the money. It's also about enjoying the process. It's also about making sure that it's helping people because you can make a bunch of money, but if it's at the expense of others or even the expense of yourself, it's not going to be very fun, right? It's not going to be, it's not going to be good. So making sure that when you're quantum leaping, it's in the best and highest good of all who are involved. And so I share that with you because when I started the quantum leap, I had no idea that any of that was going to happen. I thought it might've come, I knew it would probably come from my business in one way or another, but going to this, you know, this training and saying, Hey, I'm going to do a live event, setting up the live event and doing the whole thing. I just, I didn't see it happening. And within nine months, we went from doing $50,000 a month to doing, we 10 X our monthly revenue. Now it hasn't always stayed at that high level, right? We've had months where it's dipped down and, and things like that. But ultimately hitting that standard now makes it to where it's like, okay, I know it's possible and I know what I need to do to get back to those levels and even beyond. And so I encourage you, if you're out there to begin to start thinking in the form of quantum leaping, right? Going from where you're at to making a huge jump into a new reality. 
And as I mentioned, all right, warning, warning, warning. When you are quantum leaping, it is going to challenge you to become a person that you currently are not. And, you know, at the end of the day, let's take money out of this. At the end of the day, manifestation, what it's truly about is the, the person that you become as you go on that journey, as you begin to manifest this new life. It's the leadership you develop, the, the, the team that you develop, the mindset you develop, the experiences. You know, I'm not who I was a year ago. Since then, we've done multiple live events, multiple trainings, and all these amazing things. And so I share that with you because when you are manifesting, always remember, even if the manifestation doesn't come true or doesn't come true as fast as you want, it's about who we become along that journey. And also, if you're a business owner, you're like, Dom, I would love to 10x my, my revenue in, in nine months or even double. Shoot, most people would be happy with 50% increase and you wanna make those quantum leaps, and you're a business owner, a legit business owner, not like, oh, I have a little side thing that I do five hours a week, no. You're in it, you're all in on your business. What I want you to do is there's a link down in the description to book a free assessment with my team so we could do a deeper dive to figure out what are some subconscious blocks that are holding you back and how we could get your mind to really focus and harness and make that quantum leap because having somebody there to help you is always gonna speed up that process of manifestation. And lastly, if you guys are somebody who you're like, wow, Dom, I would learn, I would love to learn how to do self-hypnosis. Like, how do I do this for myself? Or maybe you're like, how do I, you're a business owner and you have teammates. You're like, how do I hypnotize my team to perform better, to make more sales, to be happier, to be more productive, to be dedicated to what we're doing, to buy into the mission. Or if you're somebody like me and you want to help other people through hypnosis, there's also a free hypnosis training down in the description Go ahead and get that access to that into your information. And I'm gonna show you some of the steps on how you can learn to do hypnosis so you can help yourself and you can help others. All right guys, so thank you for watching. See you in the next video.